Today's tip to your mailbag question comes to us from New York. Robert, with all the new regulations surrounding rosewood, has no one come up with a substitute for this species of wood? Dave in New York. Actually, Dave, someone has. There's a new product out called Rock Light. Now, recently, LMI sent me some samples. Let's go over to the bench and take a look. The bindings, fretboard, and bridge blank material you see on my bench may appear to be Indian rosewood. However, don't be fooled. This is a product called Rock Light and is made to appear like genuine Indian rosewood. Recently, LMI sent me these samples to test, and I couldn't wait to try them out. So, I started by making a classical guitar bridge out of the bridge blank. In the process of making the bridge, I discovered that it machines really well, just like real wood. I used it in the joiner, chop saw, table saw, and drill press, and then shaped the bridge using files, rasps, and a chisel, and then finished with sandpaper up to 320 grit, followed by a coat of the O'Brien Guitars Lou 3 Wax. The finished product weighs 16 grams. And I believe this could offer an interesting total advantage as well. I also slotted the fretboard blank and found that it cut smoother and cleaner than fretboards made from rosewood, ebony, and other species. It also doesn't chip like regular wood does. The bindings were bent on a bending iron, and I found that they bend easily, but will still break just like regular wood if you get in a hurry while bending. Another benefit of rock light is that it's very stable and uniform in color. It doesn't have any of the grading issues associated with regular Indian rosewood. It's made from a sustainable, real hardwood. Now, you would think that being a man-made composite, that each piece would be exactly the same with all the same grain pattern and color. This is not the case. Each piece is unique, has its own personality and grain color. So, thank you, LMI, for turning me on to this fantastic product. I think it's going to be a winner, and I really enjoyed working with it. Thank you.